this is Els coming to you from Bemis Crafty Corner, and this is the after the sale. So uh, today I had a sale, and I do have some items that are still remaining, and so I want to give everybody a chance to take a look at them in without having to watch, you know, a three-hour sale. So, because even at two times speed, that's still an hour and a half. So, the first item that I have for you today is this one right here, and this is wallpaper. Now, this is a cut-down piece. This is smaller than the one you will receive. The one that you receive is 12 inches by 20 inches. It is slightly larger than this one that you're looking at. This is an extremely, um, you can see, very extremely textured piece of wallpaper, um, and it does come rolled. You'll get it rolled like this. This is item A, and these are $2 a piece. If you want them, simply email me, IM me, or you know, contact me, however it is you want to contact me. That is item A. Now, item B are the United Kingdom version of the Alice in Wonderland postcards. This is item B, and there are 10 random cards in each set. They are $5, and they include multiple styles. So you have your standard colored versions. You have the black and white pencil versions of the cards. You will have the sepia versions, all included in one set. Uh, they are at random. These are re original postcards, so you can mail these if you want to, put them in a book, whatever it is that you want to do with them. Um, but they are $5 a set, and if you're interested in getting a set of these, just put item B in the request, and I will get you the invoice for them. That is item B, the Alice in Wonderland UK postcards. The next item I had uh, was some fat quarters. I have a few of these left. This is item C, and I will open one of these to show you what they look like. This is a generous fat quarter of vintage fabric. Let's go ahead and take a look at that. Uh, that's half the fat quarter, obviously. Uh, beautiful color here. That is a C, and that is a fat quarter. I'm selling these through this video only at the sale price of two dollars, and that is item C. And I'm just gonna... all right. So the next item that we have up is this one here. This is item D. This is a two and a half inch wide piece with a rose motif of a dark burgundy wine colored lace. I have approximately three yards of this left. So if you're interested in this item, just send me an email or a text or an instant message with the letter D and the quantity that you would like, and I'll be happy to add this to your order. All right, so let's take a look at item E on the list. Item E is this set of Prima art tiles, six pieces, and they are flowers and birds. Six pieces on this one. Uh, it is does not have a name on it specifically. It's the, It just says art tiles. Six pieces on this one. Brand new in the package. That is item E and that is for the huge price of da -da -da -da, I'm kidding guys. You know there's never a huge price around here. Um, they are $2, $2 for item E, item F is this item here. Again, $2 for this. This is 20 pieces. These are from uh, American Crafts. Let me go ahead and bring that up so you can see it. And that is a fall theme, fall colors. And that is item F. Again, $2 on that as well. G is this item right here. 
This is the uh, Ex Libres. Uh, it is the library cards that you would get with the Vintage Reader's Digest sections. So you get the original card with six of the original library labels. These are clear. And the original library reminder card in here, okay? So you'll get the whole set for $2. And that is item G. Item H is this item right here. This is uh, We Are Memory Keepers Urban Windows Collection Alphabet Restorations. That's what the letters look like. They are about an inch and a half tall and one inch wide. You can see they're quite different. The tag on here says $9.99. This will be a $3 item, and this is item H. Okay? So this is item H, if you're interested. Okay, I'll be right back with I, J, K, and L. All right, so the next item we have is item I. Item I is the canvas stickers. I originally had these in three different shapes, uh, butterflies, hearts, and flowers. All I have left um, are three of the butterflies. All of the rest of these sold out. I will be getting more in, so look for them in my store, but these last three sets of butterflies will be honored at the sale price. Just $1 for eight canvas stickers uh, shaped. It's a pretty good adhesive on here. Uh, you can use these with your alcohol inks. You can use these with your gelatos. Use them with your sprays. Use them with paint, however you want to do it. This is item I, and they're $1, okay? <clears throat> so we're going to go ahead and put that off to the side. Item J is this little cutting die here. It's a champagne flute little champagne glass. It's two dollars for this cutting die. It's brand new, never been used. A champagne glass for J for two dollars. And K is this little Easter egg with the bow in the middle. That is item K. Again, brand new, never been used. Two dollars. Item L is this large circle, scalloped, inside scallop circle, and ornament piece. These are two cutting dies for three dollars and that is item L. All right, moving on. Item M is this item right here. These are wrist corsage bases. Uh, you get two of them for three dollars. This is item M. Two wrist corsage bases for three dollars. Item N is this set from 2005. It's a set of eight Stampin' Up woodblock stamps, brand new, never used. This is the fun filled set. Here's all of your blocks and your stamps and the stickers that coordinate. This is $8 for sale only. This is item N, as in November. Item O are these right here. This is a $1 item. You will receive the envelope, which is your planting envelope. It tells you the kind of seed, when you purchased it, what your variety was, when you planted it, when you harvested it. Um, your seasonal planting planner, your seasonal garden chore list, your plotting grid, you'll receive two of those. So it's five pieces of gardening ephemera for a dollar. And I have three of these. And this is item O, as in Oliver. Okay, that is item O. Item P is this item right here. And this is a 20-pack 
of these satin, satin-esque um, leaves. These leaves are about one and a half, just over one and a half inches long, and they are about an inch wide, and you get 20 of these in the set for a dollar. This is item P, okay? I'll be right back with the uh, rest of the alphabet. All right, let's take a look at item Q, as in queen. This is the Paper Source Accordion Book Binding Kit. It is a kit that includes everything you need to get you started making your own accordion book. So this is item Q for $4. Item R is, again, from the uh, paper company. This is, uh, it's from the paper source, and this is a Sweet Magnolia paper flower kit, and it creates three large flowers, and it contains the sheets of paper, the pattern and instructions, wire, and the floral tape. Let's take a look at the back. So you've got all your paper here. There's several colors, your wires, your floral tape, everything that you need. These list at $14. I took them down to $8 in the sale, R is the Sweetheart Magnolia. Number, uh, letter R is $8. And then S is this one right here. And this is, again, from the paper source. This is the Spring Magnolia Paper Flower Kit. And this kit contains everything that you need to make five flowers. So you've got all your paper here, your floral tape, your wire ribbon, and more paper down underneath. Again, this list at $14, and I'm selling it for $8 today, and that is item S. Item T is this one right here. It's the last one I have. Uh, this one is similar to the bugs, butterflies, and feathers that we often sell. This is a set of Paradise Ephemera. Uh, this is item T for $1. All right, I'm going to get the rest of the items together, and we shall take a look. All right, item U, as in Union, is a four-pack of vintage Flexi Lace seam binding. Uh, this is a three-yard pack in old rows, unopened. This is a two-and-a-half yard of the wide, light pink, unopened, a Three yard, pack, three yard pack of the number four blue, unopened. And what is a full pack of the red wide, unfortunately it is opened. The uh, package kind of disintegrated on me. Uh, so that is item U and the <clears throat> hem tape is uh, four pieces in the bag for five dollars and that is item U. Item V is another set of hem tape. Again it is a four pack for five dollars. This is the wide light pink unopened, the thin old rose unopened, three yards of the wide blue This may have been opened and used. Uh, and then three yards unopened of the orchid. Okay, so that is item V, $5 for item V. Item W is this one right here. This is a full size. Double, doubled fabric, and when I say doubled, I mean that it is doubled. There's two sheets of fabric here, so you could take it apart if you wanted to. Um, linen table placemat, okay? It is approximately eighteen inches across and about. 
12 inches, 12 and a quarter inches uh, tall. It has four pieces on the corner plus the center art. This could be very easily cut in half and used as a cover on two books uh, if you chose to do so. This is item W. And it is three dollars. Three dollars for item W. <clears throat> Okay. Now, the next one I have up is item X, and uh, this is the only other real piece of lace trim, you know, like doily that I have left from today's sale. <clears throat> Excuse me. This is item X. This is a beautiful doily. It is about ten and a half inches in diameter. Ten and a half inches across. Um, this is item X, and this one is three dollars. Three dollars for item X. If you are interested. All right, let's take a look at item Y. Item Y um, is a pretty popular item. Uh, I've seen this in quite a few sales, and I have seen it sell for far more than what I am asking for uh, in much worse condition. Um, <laughs> I mean, I'm going to be honest. Uh, so this is one of the vintage look photo albums, and this one actually has its cover. Okay, I've never seen one sell with its cover before. <clears throat> but it does have its cover. The lace, the ribbon here for the closure is intact. The book itself is in great condition. There are no tears or anything on this. All of the rice paper is intact. The photo frames are in great condition. There's, of course, you know, the, the onion paper, excuse me, the onion paper, and there's a sheet between each um, set of pictures. So archival copy here. And it is a total of 24 picture pages. This is uh, copyrighted in 1998. So this is item Y. And it is the photo album with cover. in fantastic condition. And this one is $8. $8 on this one, guys. Okay? So that is item Y. I'll be right back with the last items in the auction today. All right, so the next item that I have uh, is, uh, granted, this is a very limited market on this one. This is uh, item Z. And this is a tattoo special yearbook, 2013-2014, and it is from the UK and Ireland. It sells for uh, about four pounds in the UK and about ten dollars in the US. And what this is is basically a best of kind of tattoo artist image books. And so you know, here's a green man, and you've got. Johnny Cash. You have all kinds of images in here and designs. Now, this is magazine paper, and it is magazine paper throughout. So what you would standard find in the U.S. for, uh, like, a magazine cover is the quality of the paper that is used in this. A lot of black and white images, lots of bright colored images. This would be great for image transfer if that would be something that you're into. Again, I know this is a limited market, but 
it is something that is unique and so I want to go ahead and offer this for you um, so this is item Z and it is eight dollars um, so eight dollars on this one uh, for the Tattoo Artist UK Ireland Edition Special Yearbook, okay? Number one is this one right here. This is a vintage piece of peach and cream lace. And I'm going to take this all off the board because I want to actually measure how much is here, and then I'll give you a price uh, for the last remaining piece. One, two, three, four, five. It's about five and a half feet long. Uh, it was selling for uh, $2.50 was the final price on this per yard. I will give you what is left here. So five and a half feet, nearly two yards of this would come to, if you want to buy the whole thing, uh, it's two fifty dollars for the yard, um, but if you buy the, the last piece, you really have to take the end of it. So I'll do this whole piece. Uh, so let's see, it was two fifty dollars for the yard, it's almost three. So I'll do $4 for this whole piece, okay? So $4 for five feet, five and a half feet, just six inches shy of uh, two yards, okay? For four dollars. All right, so then the other one that I have is this one here. Again, this is a vintage lace. Let me get this out of the way. This is a vintage piece. There's five yards left of this. Um, I'm gonna bring this up so you guys can see it. Okay, and this one is $2 a yard, and I have five yards available, and this is going to be item number two. So if you're interested in item number two, just send me an email, okay? All right, guys, so here's how you get to me. You can email me. Email me at Bema's Crafty Corner, all one word, at gmail.com. You can instant message me through Facebook at Elsbet Talon, E-L-Z-B-E-T, T-A-L-L-O-N on Facebook. Um, all the links will be in the little graphic at the end. Just pause the video. You'll be able to see it all right there. And that's it, guys. That's all I have for after the sale. I want to thank you so much for taking the time to sit through what I hope is a very short video compared to the actual sale. If you want any of these items, just let me know. Um, if not, I will put them in the shop and list them at their regular sale price. Okay? Until the next time, guys, if you didn't so already, go ahead, hit the red button for me, and subscribe. Like me, ring my bell, and share me with all your friends. Because I have regular monthly sales, and I host sales for other people as well. So if you're really interested in looking for things to buy and purchase unique items, check out my listings on a weekly basis and see who I'm hosting, see what I'm selling. Okay? Bye-bye now. Thank you.